Hi, and welcome to Steam Powered Family. Today we're doing a really fun and very quick and simple project making an inertia hat. So you just need some very basic supplies for this project. You don't even need that water bottle because you can use people's heads, which is why kids love this project and it's so much fun. We're gonna take an old wire coat hanger and we're gonna snip off the hanger part. You can do this ahead of time. Um, if you don't want your kids doing it, depending on how old your students are that are doing this project. And then we're just going to use some pliers and we want to get it nice and straight. So you can do it mostly with your hands, but the pliers do help make it a little bit easier just to make sure that it's really nice and straight. If you have the budget, you could definitely buy wire for this, but we prefer to try and use recycled materials. So we're going to measure our wire and you want to find the center point and then you want to mark seven centimeters from the center point on either side. So those are our measurements. Now, we're making basically a big M, if that makes sense to you. So the center point is going to be down, so that's kind of the inside of the arc of our M. And then we're going to go to both of those seven centimeter points that we marked off, and that's where we're gonna to start to angle it down. So that's where our M is gonna come down. And it's going to take a little fiddling. It's really important with this project that you have balance and symmetry. So when you're working this into your STEM lessons, you can definitely work that math into it and how we want to find that balance and symmetry so that it'll work perfectly. Now we're going to use some tennis balls. You could actually replace this with other items like airplanes, birds, all sorts of cool things you could put on here. We're going to attach one on either side, just like that. And our inertia hat is actually done. Now it's time to play. This is such a cool project. We're doing ours here on a pop bottle while we test it. And you want to make sure that it is perfectly symmetrical and balanced. So just fiddle with it until it's perfect. And as you can see, when you spin it, it'll spin around and around and around without falling. You can do this on your head as well. Now, the cool part is if you move the bottle or if somebody turns around while wearing this on their head, it will actually stay in place while they're turning. It is really fun and really interactive and just a great project to do with your kids. If you want more project ideas like this or more information on the science behind this project, please visit steampoweredfamily.com. Bye for now.